should cease all hostile engagement and prepare for Battle Royale match transport in five, four, three, two, one. Sound familiar? It should. This is the Battle Royale that was supposed to be the game breaking change the BR genre needed. This was going to be the Fortnite killer before Apex Legends was even like popularized, before it even came out. Islands of Nine was a game that you could purchase for $40 on Steam and it gave you full access to the whole new game that everyone was looking forward to. With Islands of Nine being the latest battle royale of its time, it had a lot of things going for it. Movement, on the fly weapon customization, quick 15 minute matches, a firing range, proximity chat, and best of all, uniqueness. This was the game that everyone saw had potential. Hell, even I had hopes for it. I paid for the game, but at the time, you had to have a decent running computer, which I did not have. I had a cheap gaming laptop that could barely run Fortnite at the time. And when this game hit the market, I was so ready to be one of the top players and finally throw away Fortnite. Unfortunately, by the time I had gotten a decent PC, the game was already dead. The game felt like it had barely been out. And I hadn't even had a chance to play a game that I spent money on. The game was so crazy popular with lots of creators and players. Now, it's all gone. The development team ceased to continue updates and eventually shut down the servers. However, earlier this year around May, the developers started to try and bring the game back with posting new updates, patch notes, and opening a server to the player base so that we could finally try and get this game back up and going. The game has been free to play since 2018 when they shut the servers down. However, no one's been there to play it. There have been no servers open for anyone to try it. With this new information it is now up to the community to see that this game comes back to life via word of mouth content creators maybe some advertising from the devs is what will bring this game back up the advertising part is not as much of a key factor in this as word of mouth because word of mouth is going to be the strongest way to get the player base back telling your friends hey guess what servers are back up you want to try it people are willing to try something that's free to play what do they have to lose time in their lives it's not like you're spending money on the game anymore it's free to play so keeping all this in mind the community is going to be hosting a game tomorrow saturday november 19th at 6 p.m Eastern Standard Time. I will be there and I will be gaming on Sunday as well for anybody that doesn't get a chance to play this game or try it out. For those of you who have wanted to try it, now is the time. Make sure that you are in the Islands of Nine Discord, which I will link in the description below for anybody that needs it. Also, Make sure that you are subscribed to my channel with that little notification bell turned on so that you get any updates regarding the game. I'm going to try my best to be on top of it as possible just because I want to see this game come back alive. I'd love to see it. This game had so much potential and now's the time to try and see that potential through. Leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below or shoot me a message in the Discord if you're looking to get in on some of these games. I'll give you all the information you will need so that you can join us tomorrow or on Sunday for any of the community games that are going to be hosted. My name is Hypernova, and I will see you in the dome. Later.